First up, we wanted to know how is life on the Gold Coast and is it much different to playing in Melbourne? I'd say there's a stark contrast. Um, for one, the weather up here is beautiful. Uh, you can just go on like the last week, it's been about 20, 25 every day and I know I'm speaking to a few mates down in Melbourne that's quite cold. Um, so on that front, yeah, it's, it's quite different and then just purely um, coming from a big club that gets a lot of coverage to a club that's a, a a bit quieter, a bit out of the limelight is, um, I'd say, it's quite a big difference, yeah. And when you were younger, what club did you support? Uh, growing up in Sydney, I went for the Swannies. Um, I used to go out and watch them a fair bit on a Sunday afternoon with my granddad, so, yeah, I'd have to say the Swans. Now, Steve-O's asked, what do you like to do outside of footies? Any, any hobbies, any things you like to do? Obviously, the beach is going to be one of them. Yeah, definitely. I like to get down to the beach um, of a morning, um, especially at the moment. It's, it's beautiful down there, so that's probably one thing. Um, if the body's feeling pretty good, I'll try and have a hit of golf. But uh, apart from that, I haven't been doing too much else, to be honest. Fair enough. Now, there's a young guy called Lachlan who actually wants to get into AFL himself. He wants to know if you had any advice for him, things he should be doing, or uh, anything that he can do to better himself as a footballer. Um, well, I got into AFL pretty late, so I think the thing for me was just to always have a foot in my hand, um, just get used to kicking it around, just kicking it back to yourself, um, picking it up off the ground, just all sorts of little things. So I'd say just keeping a footy in your hand as much as possible around the house, annoying mum and dad with it, breaking stuff. So now that'd probably be my one piece of advice. Perfect. A bit more of an AFL question here. Um, as a ruckman, what are your thoughts on the introduction of the third man up for? I love it and I, I think you'll find that most, um, most ruckmen do enjoy not having to worry about um, third man coming into the contest so yeah it just helps I mean you don't get knees in the kidneys and, and things like that and it just allows it to be more of a one-on-one -on -one, um, contest which is what which is what as a ruckman you want to be able to do. We had a lot of people ask if you have been playing AFL Evolution if you have what are your thoughts on the game and if not are you keen to try it? Um, no I haven't I haven't actually had a crack at it yet I mean if it was there yeah sure I'd love to have a go but no I haven't haven't had a play on it yet.